So guys, this video is for all immigrants who will be traveling back to Africa by passing Bologna Airport. Now, there is some quick notice that you have to know before you pass through Bologna Airport to Africa, any African country that you are going. So far as you pass through Bologna Airport, that is BLQ Airport, then you need to watch this video and try to share this video for me. I know people from Modena, Castelfranco, Reggio Emilia, Carpi, Forlì, Chazena, Ravenna. Most of you pass through Bologna Airport before going to Africa. It is very, very important for you to watch this video and try to share this video for me. Now they are doing one or two development at the Bologna airport. So the check-in will be very, very slow this day. So if you know this time around, you will be traveling, then you need to be very, very careful. This video is for you. Now I want to read the Italian part and I also read the English part and then we will be going to watch the video as well. Now presentati in aeroporto con almeno tre ore di anticipo. Causa lavori ai controlli di sicurezza si consiglia di arrivare in aeroporto con almeno tre ore in anticipo rispetto all'orario di partenza del volo più dettagli. So as I said before, we will be going to watch the video. Now they are saying, please show up at least three hours early due to work at security check. We recommend that you arrive at the airport at least three hours before the flight departure time guys normally if you are going to travel if you are going to the airport you need to be at the airport maybe one hour or two hours ahead of the flight you don't need to be start going maybe if you have the flight 30 minutes before you said i have 30 minutes so i can reach there no guys if you are traveling at the airport you need to be always there like one hour two hours before your flight but because now they are doing some works they are telling you to be there three hours ahead guys it is very very important i'll be doing a video for those people who will be traveling for the first time at the airport what you need to know what you need to do what you don't need to do at the airport as your first time of traveling at the airport is very very important so that you will not reach there and people will start to begin looking at you that no this guy that is the first time this girl that is the first time you understand if you get some tips before arriving at the airport it will help you a lot because at least you know how how to go about if you get some tips before getting at the airport guys this is very very important don't make mistake because going to the airport two hours three hours ahead is very very important especially for international flights if you know that you are going to Africa always you need to be at the airport on time to do your check-in do your everything then you will be waiting for the flight it's not that the flight will come there and be waiting for you there are some places if they close check-in it will be very difficult for them to do what to allow you to take the flight you need to wait for the next available flight now let's show the video when we are back we will give you the rest of the update so stay Ci troviamo all'interno della prima fase dei lavori di riconfigurazione della sala partenze Schengen. In particolare questa prima fase riguarda la realizzazione di un corridoio esterno al termine esistente che però una volta terminato avrà tutte le caratteristiche di un vero e proprio ampliamento perché sarà chiuso, climatizzato e riscaldato. Questo corridoio serve per collegare l'area check-in all'area controlli di sicurezza, in quanto il corridoio esistente verrà completamente inglobato all'interno dell'attuale sala partenze Schengen, generando un aumento di spazi di circa 800 metri quadrati. L'ampliamento della sala partenze Schengen riguarderà anche la riconfigurazione degli spazi interni, quali esercizi commerciali, spazi operativi, aree gate room e infatti ogni gate avrà a disposizione un'area accodamento e un'area seduta dedicata. Inoltre aumenterà il numero di sedute che arriveranno ad essere quasi il doppio di quelle esistenti. Inoltre abbiamo terminato nel mese di settembre i lavori di riconfigurazione dell'area esterna al primo piano. In particolare i lavori hanno riguardato l'ampliamento del marciapiede antistante l'ingresso dell'area stazione al primo piano la riqualificazione estetica della facciata della pensilina, è stato inoltre riqualificato il parcheggio insistente sul viadotto al primo piano all'interno del quale sono stati rifatti gli asfalti, la segnaletica, 
oltre che ottimizzato il numero di stalli parcheggio grazie anche all'aumento della superficie viabile attraverso la chiusura dei pozzi di luce con grigliati carrabili. Inoltre nel percorso che collega il Marconi Express all'entrata del terminal è stato realizzato un esercizio commerciale ad oggi in fase Ragazzi, di... Ragazzi, spero che avete visto il video, quindi se volete sapere più tips sul vostro primo time at the airport, guys, let me know in the comment section below. Try to share this video and subscribe to the channel for me. Sharing the video doesn't take anything from your account, but it gives me the moral to do what? To give you update day in and day out because now the videos that I'm doing, YouTube is not paying me, Facebook is not paying me, but if you try to share the video and we get more views, I'll also start getting some benefit and it will give me moral, it will ginger me to give you update day in and day out. And guys, today's video was sponsored by Top Connect. Top Connect is the best application that allows you to send money back to Africa. You can use Top Connect to send money back to Nigeria, to Ghana, guys, without paying any sending fee. The rate is something else. It's super, super, super very good. So guys, go and download the application on App Store or Google Play. If you want to send money through mobile money, through cash pickups, Top Connect allows you to do all these things. If you have bank accounts in Africa, you can use Top Connect to send money direct to your African bank accounts. And guys, remember, you don't pay any sending fee or any commission. The money that you are sending, the same amount Top Connect will allow you to send. And guys, till we meet again in the next video, please stay safe and seamless. Peace out.